Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Good morning. I am very very much aware that members of parliament of a PF they've been sitting saying no for a president that have been paid for catching over this case and I'm sure let me remind you that you were kicked out of power because you don't want to listen to what is on the ground I want me from shape of a bomb band of why chair as you sit to say no the president must come from you as members of parliament ask yourselves this question how many of you are able to interact with an ordinary or average citizen it's not all the time that people want money from you they want to talk to you they want to feel like oh okay don't sit there on my jacket i'm forcing a few for because of parliament to say no president that's a joke that's a joke leave dr shimba kambwiri to be the president because all oh, what is happening favors his mouth and the rest of his body activities to take on the ruling government if you hate him as an individual then love him in the best interest of the party pf and its future mwirai kala mwapango tuma utubu tuma tuma meeting at no president akafwe paronga takafimba you can't win as an election you people there you are you you detached yourselves from the ground won't say mama won't say mama mp is ndemi vera kufirelo the party pf is a pro poor party the party pf is a grassroots party the party pf its political stamina and dominance is in the grassroots that is where you detach yourselves from and don't start talking about presidents now we are my mccs it seems you are too stubborn despite what we were telling you before elections the articles we wrote you have continued being stubborn and you want to impose a leader on the on the party on the party stop it it's time you humbled yourself and said ah no they can do whatever they land the punch don't bring a leader no we want to rebrand it because hh has been corporate so we want someone who's been corporate that is not pfu that is not pf that is not pf if hh won an election because it was corporate you might as well win an election because you've gone back to the ground and pf did not lose because people don't like pf pf lost an election because people didn't like the leadership that is the fact whether you like it or not you stopped listening to what was happening on the ground you must be ashamed that you couldn't even have a day to say look let's address challenges that are affecting the youth on the ground the women on the ground the vendors the marketeers the bus drivers instead you used a few thugs to intimidate people and you use those thugs as a measuring tape to determine the party's strength on the ground in terms of the youth to you the youth was just intercity and not students not young women not young men nothing so and you were too selfish and greedy 
Today, I want to make it clear in this voice note. Personally, as Maxwell Chongo from the time BF won an election, I have never attended any government function until to have Mapu. Katrishi, if I ever attend any government function, maybe when UPND decides to invite me for a function, because you believed in tax to intimidate your own members that were creative. You couldn't even give us anything. I never benefited anything from PF because PF had no reward system for its party members, structures, or sympathizers. But today, I'm being taken to my investigative wings to my what to say no Max benefited, benefited. I benefited what? Can someone tell me any leader to say no? It's financial and that oh, but I'm doing a phone Max to say that that can be also in the way so now business here so even just to supply tissue or toothpick nothing. And you the same click. In fact, again the chairman was right. The same people now you want to come back and impose the president on on us. If you don't want CK, that is your personal opinion. But the general opinion says CK must lead. It's his time. And we are not going to be sorry for suggesting that CK should be the president because your hatred towards CK is just so disturbing. And we will not allow CK to start talking on his own or on his behalf. No. We'll talk and we'll tell you off. Because you've put us in a mess because of your careless decisions and you want to continue those decisions. But no, let's put this one, this one, this one what? This one what? You want to suggest someone who was MMD as the party president and you want to suggest someone who was MMD as secretariat. Is that what Sata wanted in 10 years, his party to go that direction? And you are there comfortable on a jacket. No, we are making the correct decision. Which correct decision? Who have you consulted? You made decisions you go to our opponent. And you want to continue the same useless decisions in the name of no, we are senior members of the party, which you up we are in opposition, we'll tell you the truth. And if you think no, we are going to be sugarcoating, we are not going to be sugarcoating. If you want to send your boys, we are aware that you formed a group. You are sending boys to start fighting us, to start taking us to investigative, investigative wings, destroying the, the, the image of UPND, because you want to use those people you appointed to fight those you feel like you are, you are your competitors. So that you want to UPND left. UPND the, your president told you to forgive people forgive everyone your president told you not to use investigative wings to fight people do that because pf is now using that to destroy you and people are getting angry with you today if you call for a by election in Osaka, upnd you want to win because people are angry with you they think you're the ones doing it when it's pf doing it on your behalf so I know what you are discussing. This should be the last time you are doing it. We are not going to tolerate that rubbish. We can't allow Sata's dream to just die. Ten years in opposition, ten years in ruling. If we are preparing for twenty years, when you've got children that are uh, over twenty-one years and what not, you want a, a brilliant dream like that to just die in twenty years? Nonsense. Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.